having some Nigerian jollof. So Niger jollof and Ghana jollof, which one is the best? Give me that Your auntie has used them. <laughs> you say which one is better now? Hello, welcome to my channel once again, once again. Charlie, you know that um, for some time now, it's been Nigerians mostly who come to Ghana and they try Ghanaian food all the time. They try Ghanaian food day in, day out to see how it tastes like. And most of them have actually loved it you know sometimes they will be on social media saying that ghana food is food for the girls ghana food is this ghana food is that now we have also switched and i have some Ghanaians who have actually also tried nigerian foods and i'm here to share with you and also for you to see their reaction to the food that they tasted so let's watch good music from kina dice kill it min pen pen do min pen pen die Mommy, my Ghanaian friend, they enjoy her. I ever with. What is this called? Obono. Hey, Wendy. Lele, lele, lele. Lele, lele. You are missing. The lady wants to spoil our video. Uh uh. Hey. It's a hard work. It's a hard work. This one. Yeah. 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 So what's up? How is the food? It's sweet. Like, uh -huh. hmm. Ghanaian, so what? Oh my god. Oh. Argue with your phone. Yes, argue with your phone. Me, argue with your hands. You can chop your hands for all I care. <laughs> Guys, I, I'm not left at all. I still have my own. I still have my own. But you know, say. As we do like this. Nice. Because chopper. Because chopper, where, where? Where, where, where? Namato Sheno. Namato Sheno. Mamma, mamma, yo. That's what I'm going to be doing, say more. My children tell me you're not going to be on your neck, on your neck, now you shall so. On it, you want to make your mother. What was your mother when you're at it? Oh, Sandra, you're not going to be on your neck, you're not going to be on your neck. Trying Abacha in the streets of Accra. This is so interesting to see. I can't believe this. It's basically cassava with baga, which is palm nuts, and then some garden eggs. And she added pepper as well to give the spice kick. This, this is the goosey soup, and this is uh, vegetable soup. Then this very one is semobita. That's one of semobita, and this is gari. So now let me open the gari for you to try it. Then you tell me which one you prefer. And it's like 
Trying Nigerian jollof for the first time. All I will say is we have a problem. We have eba and egusi soup with a bono soup, rice and egusi soup. So my friend here is going to try rice and egusi soup for the first time. Yeah, so you will try it and tell us how nice the food is. Yeah. Okay, this is actually Ghana rice. <laughs> Ghana rice with um, Nigerian soup. Exactly. Mm -hmm. That's cool. All right. Nice one. Mm -hmm. So how it's is not it? Bad. <laughs> it's nice. This tastes just like there is a, a stew in Ghana. We don't call it soup. Mm. Contome mm -hmm. and we don't say a goose. We say a bushy, Like it's almost the oh, same. Okay, yeah. okay. But it doesn't taste bad. It tastes nice. Okay. If yeah. you are to rate it with ten percent, what would you say? I'll uh, give it um, seven. Seven. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. Are you sure? Our sure. Nigerian food seven. <laughs> oh, I disagree with you. I will come and try mine too. So this is for Henawa, aka Linda Way. <laughs> So she's trying um, eba with egusi soup and um, ogbono soup. Mm. 
Yes. So is this your first time trying? This is my first time trying a Nigerian dish. Wow. So let's see how it goes. Uh -huh. I'll be trying the Obono soup first. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Let me see how. Hmm. Mm. Rolling. Yeah, 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 yeah. My sister. I love this. <laughs> I love this. These are my Ghanaian family. Let me see the Ebusi. Mm -hmm. Try, try. Like try. my sister said, it's almost like Ghana contemporary stew. Oh, right, try it, try it first. I always taste nicer than this one. Okay. Mm. So what can you say about this? Okay, let's let's talk about the two soup. Which one do you prefer? The Obono soup. Okay. I love it more than the Ebusi. Okay, yes. okay, okay, okay. This is just like an okra soup. Yes. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Like, yes. I like it. Yeah. And I can see the meat is well cooked. It's mm -hmm. soft and tender. And that's how we roll in Nigeria. Yeah, so I love it here. Okay. With the eba. Okay. Yeah, this is my first time and I can say I really love the food. Uh -huh. I didn't like there is a smell in the Ubusi. I didn't like it. Uh -huh. but this one. I love it. I think it uh, it depends on the, the smell cook. of Ebusi. Uh, I just don't like it. Okay, you don't like the smell generally, yes. not yes. this one. So I don't like the okay. Nigerian Ebusi, but I love the Obono. But you soup. like is there Ghana Egusi? Oh. Yeah, <laughs> we have So you like Ghana Egusi, but you don't like Nigerian Egusi? Yes. Which kind of thing be this? Is Egusi na Egusi? No, Ghana Ghana Egusi, we use it for the um, contemporary the palava sauce. Okay. That's what we use for contemporary stew. Yeah. Okay. It makes it it's almost the same as this, but the contemporary will it's match. much more than yeah, egg. but this one you can see a goosey more. Oh, okay. But and I want some and I yes. really include eggs. Okay, so that means Nigeria usually put too much a goosey in their face yes. instead of vegetables. Yes. Okay, I understand, I understand you now. Yes. So um if you had to rate this food with ten percent, what would you get? Ten percent I'm coming with the <laughs> <laughs> Okay with the Obono first. Obono can get nine. Oh, 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 honestly, Obono soup tastes very yes, nice. I'm telling you, what they mix it's one of my soup. favorite soup. Just and um, mm. there is one, is it? I found soup or so. It okay. tastes very nice. Okay. So, can you please taste the other one? This one. Mm. My sister. Mm. The rate it was. And yeah, we give six. Six. Oh, so you see, I tried. <laughs> yeah. Nigerians, I tried for you. I don't know if Sandra will taste just this, this, this soup of this. Okay, let me just taste it. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think it's the spices. Yeah, there is a. Yeah. Yeah. I've eaten Nigerian egusi soup. Mm. It has its own taste. Mm. Yeah. Compared to the Ghanaian egusi mm. soup. Yes. Yes. This one, this tastes just like Nigerian egusi mm. soup. Yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm already used to um, this. I shall go shop before you go paro. Shop before you go paro. Shop, oh. Now, wickedness. They don't they drink now. They don't they drink my power. Now, wickedness, oh. If they jam your toto, your toto don't go hear yeah, what they get. Shop before you go paro. But Charlie, me personally, I have actually tried a goosey and fufu before. And I've also tried Ofen Salah. If a Nigerian, please correct me if I'm wrong. Ofen Salah and wheat. The, that wheat, it looks like, um, how do I even say it? Kokonte. Kokonte or Abitie. The scientists will say Abitie in Ghana. But the texture actually looks like Banku. Or it feels like Banku. So Charlie, the day that I ate that food, I was like... You know, Nigerians, eh? so, like sometimes I say Ghanaians, we also love spicy foods. But Charlie, it seems like Nigerians, their spice level is more than ours. So, man, sometimes I see Nigerians in Ghana, they sell pomo, that's willy, with pepper. And the pepper is not like grinded well, or fico fico, no, 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 no. This one is like a rough one, and they eat it with it. Like mostly when they are preparing their food, like it's like they use chili. They don't use the banero pepper or they use chili so it's hot nigerian food eh, man? <laughs> so if you are someone who have tried nigerian food before you can attest to the fact that man they their spice level is more than ours imagine even normal normal food their spice level is at top notch and they are giving you pepper soup to eat bro i'm sure that very day eh? <laughs> what you will feel in your stomach eh? you had never felt that before i'm telling you because bro but you know, I think uh, most of their foods, especially ones that I have tried, I think the, it, it's not bad. I think the only thing is they call it a gushi soup. It is not soup, it is stew. You see? And it's agushi, the agushi that we have in Ghana here. 
and their fufu too is, is like they ferment the cassava before like the cassava dough they ferment it before they use it to prepare so it's more like banku but you know banku for us we add the corn dough to it that's the difference and for our fufu it's very fresh like the cassava we boil it freshly then we pound it yeah by nigeria they ferment it so that's the difference but i i think it's not bad because Charlie trying different food and they are in West Africa and I feel like some of their foods is very similar. I think Nigerians also have the Tuozafi that we have here, but I think that's in the north, the Muslim side. And they have the Akara, the Akara is Kose, Pomo is Wele. They have a lot of things that are very common with Ghana. So eating their food is not um, something that I would say is totally different from what we eat. You see, it's not bad. Let's be honest, it's not bad. Let's, <laughs> let's not demonize <laughs> everything that they have. I feel like their food is not bad. It's, it's nice. So if you haven't tried Nigerian food before, I will tell you, or I will ask you that, Charlie, try Nigerian food. They have Nigerian foods everywhere in Ghana. So um, if you are tired of perhaps eating Okonte, Bangkun, Wache, Gobe, and the Ghana Fufu, just try. They have their restaurant around, especially in Accra. They have a lot of restaurants in Accra so just try their food and I'm very sure you will love it. Thank you so much for watching.